showing you how to perform the Thomas test today. It is to evaluate the, um, if there is a complete Achilles tendon rupture. Um, so to do this, you have the patient lying in prone with their ankles off of the table. Um, and you simply squeeze the medial and lateral side of the gastrocnemius and soleus muscles. And as you squeeze it, you should get some plantar flexion if the Achilles tendon is intact. If it is not intact and is ruptured completely, you will not get plantar flexion. Um, also, you want to avoid squeezing too deep um, to get a false positive by squeezing some of the muscles that run down into the foot that do not run through the Achilles tendon. Um, you also, you want to compare to the other side and squeeze that, gastrocnemius and soleus, and it should also plantar flex. There we are. And uh, again, a positive finding would be if one plantar flexed and the other did not.